Let me give you the scoop on some of the big developments this week. So the Allen Institute for AI decided to build a 3D data set. And they did what a lazy undergrad would do. They went and found a publicly available site, scraped that entirely, did that without any type of permission, and then claimed credit for the data set. They didn't ask before they took 1 million objects. They just grabbed that data? Boy, that doesn't seem right. Hey, where's that data set located? Asking for a friend. Their mistake was not hiring a grad student. Take Meta. They're in the business of selling ads. They have a research team that helps build solutions, including for their ads team. And recently, they trained a new model, Llama, which is like a GPT-3 type model. Well, they distributed it for education as a non-commercial use. What's the big deal? It's for education, right? Come on, it's so awful, nobody would pay for that model. It's so far behind Ada, we'd have to call it Elizabeth Holmes. They say education, but basically anybody could get their hands on it. And you could read this as a way to build a market for a product that competes with OpenAI and brings down the value of their technologies. Yeah, I saw it had hundreds of thousands of downloads. I didn't think there was that many graduate students. So with this new free model, some Stanford grad students decided to upgrade it to better compete against tools like ChatGPT. They first needed data. Aren't there legitimate sources for getting training data? Yeah, we spent millions paying people $3 an hour. Nah, they built a data set by repeatedly querying OpenAI and collecting all that together. What's wrong with that? Sounds like they're go-getters. OpenAI's terms of service forbid this type of behavior, but these folks did it over 50,000 times. I get it. So they got that data from OpenAI. They then trained a model that would then compete with OpenAI. Seems kind of like cheating. Damn right it doesn't make sense. Wait till you see what we've got planned. All right, go initiate Skynet. But then we have a $30 billion company. Take that new data set, train a model as a way to compete against OpenAI and show people that they can build their own competing solution. Wait, that company that overcharges us 10x for compute? Maybe they were doing this for educational reasons. Great job with the straight face. You'll want to do it like that.